Hey guys, Epic Gamer 14 here, your guy for movies, walkthroughs, and more. Um, <clears throat> today I will be taking a look at the two video games based on the movie Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. The first one I'm going to talk about is the DS version. The DS version follows the plot of the movie, obviously. You get to use a variety of gadgets to, to defend yourselves because, you know, the whole thing with the Flint Simnifer going haywire and stuff. The Bigacious Pal is a gadget where you can smash things or push things. The Hot Enougher can melt things down like ice cream. The uh, Upsucker Plus can can s can suck up various liquids and spray them like chili, honey, and water. <coughs> <coughs> the <coughs> Chopper -er can slice things, obviously. Whilst the uh, the fork of a jigger can pick things up. Now, now the gameplay is simple. To move around, you use the stylus, and there's a gadget button that if you tap it with the stylus and and slide it up to any of the gadget icons, you'll pick that gadget. Or just press any of the buttons, uh, you know, the X, Y, A, B buttons, just to like you know get a different gadget. Uh, for to you can also upgrade your gadgets, but the currency in this game are hydronic are hydronics. To earn them, you gotta you gotta break stuff that has bulk that has blue bubbles in it. I wish I could put in the nostalgia critic joke where he says, you know. Anywho, for it you're going. For it, like for if you see a pink blob of ice cream, you can melt it down. A cheese puff, smash it, all that stuff. I haven't. You can also, if you're also low on health, you can pick up a green one that's rarely anywhere. So that's rarely anywhere. So it also gives you thirty points of hydronics. The problem I have with this game is that. This is a bit too easy. It's a bit too easy, in my opinion. You can also use the microphone, and I forgot to mention, like, see any wads of bubble gum? You can just blow into the microphone, and then you'll be carried off off with a bubble. Bubble of gum. But like I said, the problem is that it's way too... It's easy, in my opinion. Like, it's not hard enough, and if... And if you are getting damaged, there's rarely any green hydronic hydronics to help you. So you're on your own, pal. But it's an okay game. I'll let it pass. The next one, is, which is my favorite, is the console version, Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. Now there's a whole lot more stuff, like when you defeat enemies, they'll drop hydronic food pods. Now that is what... That's another problem I have with a DS game. Why can't you just let enemies that when you defeat them, hydronic food pods fall out? What the heck? Anywho, for this, I like this version better because the graphics look amazing. The, the gadgets look amazing and all. And the, I mean, the graphics look amazing and all. And you get to play co-op. That's pretty cool. There's also a bit more extras added in there, like uh, like more hydronic food pots to find, a few more, a few more things you can use, like for the um, like for the for the Upsucker Plus, you can pick up oil. You heard me right, oil, and you can spray it around to push to push giant burgers, or. And instead of chili, they are replaced it with coffee to melt things. Bit odd. I can remember if there's chili in there, but my mind just my memory slips away. It's a pretty fun game, and I hi. It's a pretty fun game to the to a to an okay movie. Now, before you say things, I'm not saying that the DS version sucks. It's okay, but. I just like I prefer the console version more than the DS version. Like and plus it's pretty fun.
so I highly recommend this. Though the only problem I have with this game is that, well, um... You know, I haven't found any problems with this game. It's basically okay. So, anywho, it's an okay game. Though, for the upgrading part, it's very weird. Here's how you get. If you earn enough hydronic food pots, the, this meter will raise up, and it says, Would you like to upgrade? And you can pick any one of the gadgets you can upgrade. Very odd. Very, very odd. So, I highly recommend these two. The DS version, I'll rank it good. For the PS3 version, I'll rank it great. Don't ask me why, just go with it. So, I'm Epic Gamer 14 your guy for Movies, Walk to Zamore, and see you around, folks, and good night.